Hey everyone and welcome back to the show. We're thrilled to have you here with us tonight. Tonight we're diving headfirst into the wild world of technology. From the latest gadgets to groundbreaking innovations, we've got it all covered. Buckle up because things are about to get interesting. We're not just talking about any tech, we're talking about the kind that's shaping our future. We're talking about China, America and a whole lot of tech tension. These two giants are in a race to dominate the tech world and the stakes couldn't be higher. Now I know what you're thinking. Tech talk on a Friday night? You wound me. But hold on, because this is not your typical tech discussion. But trust me, this isn't your average tech snooze fest. We're diving into the drama, the excitement, and the sheer innovation that's driving this tech rivalry. This is about how China is stepping up its tech game and America might be. Well, let's just say we're not used to playing second fiddle. China's rapid advancements in AI, 5G, and manufacturing are turning heads globally. Think of it like this. Remember that kid in school who always copied your homework? Well, now that kid is not only caught up, but is also coming up with some pretty impressive stuff on their own. Yeah, this is kind of like that, but on a global scale with billions of dollars in our technological future at stake. The competition is fierce and the implications are enormous. We're talking about innovations that could change the way we live, work and interact with the world around us. From smart cities to autonomous vehicles, the future is being built right now. And it's not just about the big players. Startups and innovators from all over the world are contributing to this tech revolution. The landscape is constantly evolving and it's a thrilling time to be a part of it. So grab your snacks, settle in, and get ready to explore the great tech tech takeover. Let's go. Welcome to Revo. Now your go-to channel for all things revolutionary. At Revo Now, we are passionate about exploring the innovations, breakthroughs, and game-changing ideas that are shaping the world today. Our mission is to bring you the latest and most impactful advancements in technology, science, culture, business, and beyond, all in one place. Please subscribe, like, and share our videos. We've got an incredible journey ahead, and you won't want to miss a single moment. Okay, maybe stall is a strong word. But China is definitely making moves in the tech world and it's making some people nervous. Remember when America was the undisputed king of all things tech? Yeah, those days might be numbered. It's like this. Imagine you're at a party and you've brought the best snacks. You've got the chips, the dip, the... Oh, shebang. Then someone else shows up with even better snacks. Suddenly everyone's flocking to them and you're left holding a bag of stale pretzels. That's kind of what's happening with China and the US right now. China is investing heavily in technology, developing its own innovative companies, and building its own digital infrastructure. Meanwhile, America is, well, we're still trying to figure out how to get Wi-Fi in all our subway stations. China's tech expos are bustling with new gadgets and innovations, and their universities are churning out engineers and developers at an impressive rate. On the other hand, American students are often stuck with outdated textbooks and underfunded programs. The Chinese government is also playing a significant role, providing substantial support and funding to tech companies. In contrast, the U.S. government is bogged down in debates and bureaucracy, struggling to keep up with the fast-paced tech world. Chinese tech workers are collaborating in state-of-the-art offices, while many American tech workers are dealing with cramped spaces and outdated equipment. The result? Chinese tech products are becoming more popular and widely used around the world. Meanwhile, some American tech products are starting to gather dust on the shelves. Chinese tech companies are expanding globally, establishing a strong presence in international markets. American tech companies, on the other hand, are finding it increasingly difficult to maintain their dominance. At tech conferences, Chinese keynote speakers are often the stars of the show, while American speakers sometimes struggle to capture the same level of enthusiasm. The innovations coming out of China are futuristic and groundbreaking, whereas American innovations, while still significant, tend to be more conservative. Chinese tech workers are celebrating successful project launches, while American tech workers are often stressed dealing with setbacks and challenges. The headquarters of Chinese tech companies are impressive, showcasing their growth and ambition. In contrast, some American tech companies are still operating out of older buildings, struggling to keep up with the rapid changes. The brainstorming sessions in Chinese tech companies are filled with innovative ideas and forward-thinking solutions.
Meanwhile, American tech workers are often caught up in meetings discussing how to solve existing problems. As a result, Chinese tech products are being used globally, with users expressing high levels of satisfaction. American tech products, on the other hand, are receiving mixed reviews, with some users feeling left behind. Chinese tech companies are dominating the market, setting new standards for innovation and efficiency. American tech companies are trying to catch up, but the gap is widening. The global success of Chinese tech companies is a testament to their hard work and strategic planning. American tech workers are determined to innovate and reclaim their position, but it's an uphill battle. The futuristic designs of Chinese tech companies' headquarters reflect their forward thinking approach. American tech companies, with their more traditional designs, are finding it challenging to keep pace. Chinese tech workers are optimistic about the future, confident in their ability to lead the industry. American tech workers are hopeful but cautious, aware of the challenges they face. The expanding influence of Chinese tech companies is reshaping. The global tech landscape. American tech companies are striving to adapt, but the competition is fierce. As Chinese tech workers celebrate their achievements, the world watches closely. American tech workers are planning for the future, determined to make a comeback. The tech rivalry between China and the US is far from over, and the next chapter is yet to be written. When it comes to tech giants, America has some heavy hitters Apple, Google, Amazon, the list goes on. But China's got its own crew of tech titans, and they're not messing around. Think Alibaba, the e-commerce giant that makes Amazon look like a neighborhood yard sale, or Tencent, the company behind WeChat, which is basically like Facebook, WhatsApp, and Venmo, all rolled into one. These Chinese companies are dominating the market in China and starting to make serious waves internationally. It's like this, remember that time you challenged your friend to a game of basketball, convinced you'd win only. To get absolutely schooled? Yeah, that's what it feels like watching China's tech scene explode. They're coming in hot and they're not afraid to play ball. Let's talk specifics, shall we? Huawei, the Chinese telecommunications giant, has been making headlines for its 5G technology. They're basically building the infrastructure for the future of mobile internet, and it's making some people in the US pretty nervous. Then there's WeChat, the Swiss army knife of apps that's taken China by storm. It's got everything from messaging to mobile payments to ride hailing, and it's got over a billion users. Imagine if Facebook, Amazon, and your bank were all combined into one app. That's basically WeChat, and it's changing the game for how people in China live, work, and connect. It's no wonder the US is feeling a little bit of tech envy. Your burning questions, answered probably. Now I know what you're thinking, John. This is all very concerning, but what does it actually mean for me? Well, my friend, that's the million-dollar question. The short answer is, it's complicated. But the long answer is even more interesting. First off, this tech race between the US and China could have a major impact on the global economy. Whoever controls the technology controls the future, and right now, China is looking like a serious contender. Second, this could change how we use technology in our everyday lives. From the phones we use to the apps we download to the way we connect with the world, China's tech. Influence is growing, and it's only a matter of time before we start to feel the impact. But let's break it down even further. Imagine your daily routine. You wake up and ask your virtual assistant for the weather. You use your smartphone to check your schedule and your smart home devices to adjust the lighting and temperature. All these devices are becoming more integrated and smarter thanks to advancements in technology. And a lot of these advancements are coming from China. Chinese companies are not just catching up in many areas they are leading the way. Take smartphones, for example. Brands like Huawei and Xiaomi are pushing the boundaries of what's possible. From foldable screens to 5G technology, these innovations are setting new standards. And it's not just about hardware. Chinese apps like WeChat and Alipay are revolutionizing how we communicate and transact. They offer a level of integration and convenience that is unmatched. And let's not forget about services. From ride-sharing to food delivery to streaming, Chinese companies are setting new benchmarks. The influence of Chinese technology is pervasive and growing. It's reshaping industries and redefining how we live our lives. So what does this mean for you? It means that the technology you rely on every day is increasingly being shaped by Chinese innovation. Whether it's for health, education, or entertainment, Chinese tech is becoming an integral part of our lives. And this is just the beginning. 
As China continues to invest in research and development, we can expect even more groundbreaking innovations in the future. So stay tuned, stay curious, and get ready for a future where technology knows no boundaries. America time to innovate or get left in the digital dust. So where does that leave the US? Well, it's not like America is out of the game entirely. We've still got some of the most innovative companies and brightest minds in the world. But we can't afford to rest on our laurels. China is coming in hot. And we need to step up our game if we want to stay ahead of the curve. Think of it like this. Remember Blockbuster Video? They thought they were untouchable too until Netflix came along and changed everything. The same thing could happen to the US if we don't start innovating and adapting to the changing tech landscape. So what do you think? Because we definitely need to know. This is where you come in, dear viewers. We want to hear from you. What do you think about China's rise as a tech superpower? Are you concerned about the US losing its edge? Do you think Huawei is secretly controlled by a cabal of tech-savvy pandas? Okay, maybe not that last one, but you get the idea. Head to the comments section and let us know your thoughts. We'll be reading them all week long, or at least until our interns get bored. The future of tech is sneak peek. Spoiler alert, it's complicated. Predicting the future is a fool's game, especially when it comes to technology. But one thing's for sure, the tech landscape is changing faster than ever, and the US and China are at the forefront of that change. Will China overtake the US as the world's leading tech superpower? Will we all be speaking Mandarin and using WeChat to order our dumplings? Only time will tell. But one thing's for sure. The future of tech is going to be interesting, to say the least. Buckle up, kids. It's going to be a wild ride. Can America keep up? Hint. It won't be easy. The US is facing some serious challenges when it comes to maintaining its tech dominance. China's got a few advantages, like a massive population that provides a huge market for testing and developing new technologies. They've also got a government that's willing to invest heavily in tech research and development. The US, on the other hand, well, let's just say we've got our work cut out for us. It's like trying to run a marathon against someone who's riding a unicycle. Sure, we might have experience and ahead. Start, but they've got momentum and a whole lot of weird, innovative energy on their side. Section 10. The Takeaway. Because even we have a time limit. So, what's the big takeaway from all of this? Well, for one thing, the world of technology is no longer a one-horse race. China is here to play, and they're bringing there a game. The US needs to step up its game if it wants to stay competitive on the global stage. And for another, all of this tech talk is enough to make your head spin. So, go grab yourself a snack, pour yourself a drink, and try not to think about the fact that the future of technology might involve a lot more Mandarin than you're currently comfortable with. Section 11. Join the conversation. Seriously, we're dying to hear from you. That's our show for tonight, folks. But the conversation doesn't end here. We want to hear your thoughts on this whole US-China tech showdown. Are you Team America all the way, or are you secretly rooting for the underdog? Let us know in the comments below and be sure to tell us what other burning questions you have about the world of technology. Until next time, stay curious, stay informed, and try not to let the robots take over the world. Subscribe to Revo now and join our vibrant community of forward thinkers, change makers, and revolutionaries.